Flues are used for conveying fumes resulting from the combustion of solid fuels, such as wood, pellets, and other wood biomass, to the outside air. The regulations in force impose minimum draft pressure and fume tightness and heat resistance requirements to ensure the safety and correct operation of chimney or stove system, thus preventing any possible fire. As these conditions are frequently not met, it becomes imperative to check the structural condition of the flue. With the aid of sophisticated video cameras, the materials and the dimensions of ducts are measured and pipes are also checked for potential obstructions or ruptures. The solution is the relining of the flue. Therefore, the Becker engineering system involves lining the duct with HT1000 thermosetting sheath. HT1000 is resistant to direct and continuous flames, rated as Fire Protection Class A1. The duct is previously cleaned thoroughly and swabbed so as to remove any possible deposits. Afterwards, the winch is placed at the top of the chimney stack in order to keep the HT1000 sheath tensioned, which is inserted in the flue pipe and connected to the ends of the inflation sockets. The sheath expands due to the vapour injected into it until it reaches the required dimension. In this way, the sheath fully adheres to the existing duct and the result is total sealing. The process takes place in two phases. The first catalysis process lasts around two hours and causes sheath hardening. Excess pieces can be removed afterwards. A second catalysis process takes place when hot air is injected. With the aid of a thermocouple, the temperature of the blower airflow is automatically regulated, with values ranging from 400 to 600 degrees for a certain period of time. The relining is now completed. Now the system is totally tight and can be used safely. HT1000 is an innovative, practical and safe system that can be used to upgrade flues that are to be used non-stop with temperatures above 1000 degrees for chimneys, wood stoves and wood-fired ovens. HT1000 fully adapts to any existing ducts. There is no need to erect walls, thus operation times and costs are significantly reduced.